killing time at the good old bus stop. So <laughs> the topic of this um, video is going to be men. Okay, now that topic really does not exist in my life. There's no men, <laughs> okay? There are figments of my imagination which I happen across sporadically through like kick and through Christmas and things like that, but that's never, that's not reality. That's just late at night, I can't sleep, somebody to text you or to message you. And that's not reality at all. And when I say not reality at all, that doesn't exist at all either. So, and I have allergies real bad, so I can't hear my ears are stopped up and everything. But, um, and I'm hot. I have feel like I have a fever, but I don't. So, I'm talking about men. Um, what made me think about this was just now I was looking at my phone and I got a text from um, this one guy that um, a few a few weeks ago I met him on a bus eating cake <laughs> and it was cool for the moment and um, when I say the moment I literally mean that moment on the bus and then that was it but um, we had changed numbers and you know I thought like my only need right now in life as far as like uh, emergency need is like late at night somebody just talked to to help me go to sleep so I was like well you know this person would serve at least our purpose that purpose was not really served because when you're talking to somebody and um the speech is kind of slow it kind of throws things off a little bit so <laughs> but and at one point, I think I told him just not to contact me at all. But then he contacted me after he waited a while, smart person, and then contacted me again anyways, and was, you know, his respectful self. And I was like, hey, I could use somebody to talk to. So I was like, good, <laughs> I have somebody to speak to. But I really don't have a talk to friend um, because, I mean, it's just not working out. So. Um, yeah, and then I thought, like, I like fantasy and imagination and role play and stuff like that. Nothing kinky by me saying that. It's just a matter because you can create whatever you want to create, you know. And if the other person, we're two or more gathered, if the other person wants to create whatever you're creating, then it's great. So, you know, they got into this habit, and I don't like it, and I know it means nothing in this world, but using a pet name with me, and I was like, don't do that. I don't appreciate that. But then I was like, hey, well, go along with it, you know, and so I did, and um, I don't know, I mean, they're offering to do stuff that um, people don't offer to do for me, <laughs> um, like, you know, just, but I don't think it's so much offering for me, but I think it's just because they recently got a car, like maybe a few weeks ago, and they, I guess they want a reason to use it. So they're offering to pick up this, pick up that, if I need this, that. But again, I think it's more vanity than anything else. I think it's just, you know, for the purpose of, you know, having somebody pick up. I'm sure that if he had opportunity um, to pick up a lot more people, he would. But it's just like, for me, that's not the need that I have. And I wanted to say that because um, yesterday at my day job, um, it is raining on my head, you guys. Really, it is. I didn't bring an umbrella. It's like sunny rain. And my ears are clogged. And it feels like I have both earpieces in, but I don't. But, um, I got, this has got to look insane. You know, sitting at a bus stop in the rain, like it's nothing. But, I mean, what do you do? I don't have an umbrella, so... So there, well, I mean, what the hell do I supposed to do? So, um, yeah, but anyway, so this woman that I work with, and I don't know what the situation is. Like I said, God looks out for me. And this day job, really, probably from the beginning, you know, it's only by the grace of God. I'm about to put this hoodie on. This is, see, this is the thing about being at a bus stop. No matter what. <laughs> There's going to be some aspect of just looking quite insane. Because now I'm at a bus stop in a hoodie. In the rain. Just, but anyhow. So. Okay, for those of you that wonder why I'm recording this. Because I'm passing time and I don't feel well. And I'm trying to keep myself up. That's why I'm recording this. 
but um not that anybody has said anything either way not to me but <laughs> but i'm sure people if they care they will say something but um so anyhow and i wonder if my phone's gonna get damaged probably I need a new phone anyway which i cannot afford at the moment i can't afford anything i need a job a real job but anyhow um maybe that'll be in the cards after i go pay my phone bill sad story y'all but this is so true yeah so and i need to eat i'm hungry oh but i have food i do have food i'm going to eat and then i'll record later how about that <laughs>